This is Nasu Harbour, 7.30 p.m. August the 22nd, 17.20. It is said that when pirates slept, he did not dream that he had died and gone to heaven. He dreamed that he would return to new problems. So yeah, this, this is Nasu Harbour. Plentiful food, wild people. And this is how it looked. True or false, many of the pirates in the Caribbean were black. True. In some ships nearby, half the crews were made up of black men. True or false, many pirates kept pirates. Pirates. <laughs> True. It was very common for pirates and sailors to keep pirates as pets or to bring them home from the tropics of the exotic souvenirs. Dividing the loot. There you go, you can read that. I'm fed up of reading. You can read that. Pirate democracy. And the attractions of piracy. So you now can read that. You now can see that. So yeah, the vast majority of the pirates are young seamen who are either forced into a close privacy with their ships were captured or were made redundant by the Navy and saw privacy as an easy option. And ordinary seamen in the Navy was poorly paid and endured harsh discipline and savage punishments. Life on the merchant ship was equally bleak. Piracy offered the prospect of riches, women, rum, and the warm seas of the Caribbean. Many pirates agreed with Bart Fobley Roberts, AKA Blackbeard, who was prepared to risk death for a life of luxury and ease, whose motto is was a short life, but a merry one. Shine on. And it Andrew and Paula, we love a short, merry life, don't we? Oh, yeah. Definitely, I think I'll sign up for that today. Oh, yes. <laughs> Pirate democracy, you see all these guys. It's August 27, 1720. Let's go, Nassau Harbour. True or false? The treasure map with X marking the spot was devised by the pirates. False. The pirate treasure map is fictitious and was made popular by Robert Louis Stevenson in his classic story Treasure Island. X does not mark the spot. Only Anne and Mary 